Welcome to the 25th anniversary Golden Compass Gala, where the Seafarers House honor those with undeniable courage in the maritime community. Tonight we are celebrating 25 years of wonderful service to the maritime community, and we have with us our 2014 International Golden Compass honoree, Captain Richard Phillips, who is, as everybody knows, an internationally renowned hero, and um, he is here to accept our Golden Compass Award, which we offer only to those who have done something amazing for the maritime community, and so it just seemed like the perfect time to ask him when we are on the cusp of the next quarter century of success. Jill, tell us specifically for the people that are not familiar with the Seafarers House, what type of description would you give them? I'd give us um, that we have a really important mission that we welcome strangers into our, in, in our midst. So when people come into the harbor, we give them safe harbor and support and we provide all the practical services that seafarers may need. And this evening tonight, what do you think people expect from the 25th year anniversary? I mean, there's so much excitement surrounding this evening. I think they expect a great party because we always have really good events and then this year is really special because it is the 25th year. And tell us about tonight's event, the 25th anniversary and everybody has come out in their best. They certainly have. It's going to be a wonderful, fun evening filled to capacity with the wonderful Captain Phillips joining us tonight. So we're very excited. Oh, it's fabulous and we're so thrilled because um, I started on this board about 15 years ago, At I think it was, maybe ago, 15 yeah. or 17 years ago, and we were very, very tiny and trying so hard to get people to understand the plight of these crew people who, who come in by the thousands every day into our port. And um, we have finally really been heard, I think. You know, you see 400 people coming out, to, or more, I think even 500 coming out tonight and Captain Phillips here, and you know, it's all very exciting. So we're thrilled to pieces. And the event gets bigger and bigger every year and, and so much more support from the industry, which is great because what Seafarers does is a great cause and what you know how they support the Seafarers from all over the world. And it's an unfortunate group of, it's a fortunate group of people to have Seafarers, but they have certainly challenging lives else, elsewhere in the world. And it's great to have this organization to support them when they're here. I'm here because this, the seafarers really make our whole economy and our way of life possible. And they're just totally unappreciated. And um, well, I do happen to be on the board of Seafarers House, uh, so that helps as well. But um, I've had a 33 year in the career in the United States Coast Guard. So what seafarers do, how challenging that life can be is, is really rings home to me. And now I'm a senior vice president at Royal Caribbean Cruise Line. So, Again, seafarers make our business possible and they make uh, vacations of a lifetime possible for just millions of people every year. Considering that tonight is such an important event, what is the one thing that you hope people take out from it tonight? Well, I, I think we're looking to have a, uh, a, a gala event to uh, let more people become aware of what Seafarers House is all about and hopefully have a uh, successful financial uh, outcome too because we are a nonprofit and we depend uh, very heavily on events like this to, uh, to fund the mission of Seafarers House, which is to provide services for the uh, seafarers coming into South Florida. First of all, I just want to say thank you for, for this very prestigious honor. I'm pleased and proud to accept this award and to be here with you tonight to celebrate 25 years of service to the maritime community by Seafarers House. I'm just a, a part of what all, all the seamen uh, of the world are, not, not just the United States. We, we, we do have a, a job that I think we all really enjoy doing. Uh, it is hard, it's difficult, it's arduous, and uh, we, we just enjoy being out there the, uh, to overcome the problems that we see. It's in the environment, we're, we're in the beautiful ocean, and it's uh, great to be out there at times, but, but it's just the, the work that the seamen do. You know, w without seamen bringing the world trade to us, we, we wouldn't have uh, the cheap goods, the Costco's, the Walmarts, uh, and a lot of people just don't realize what, what the Merchant Marine does. We are truly the truck drivers on the ocean, and uh, uh, what people don't realize again is that uh, 85 to 90 percent of the goods that we wear, drive, eat, consume are born on, on the water at one time, and, and the people who are doing that are the seafarers of the world bringing us the, the goods that we want so much. 
The Seafarer's House has become an iconic foundation for mariners far and wide and will continue to make a difference, welcoming all those that come from sea. I'm Andrea Ocampo for Eye on South Florida.